Morris and NBC Action News. Wow. Well, the students have concerts tonight and tomorrow night at Mid-America Dancing University in Olathe. Should be a lot of fun. All right, a hot day to be outside. And yeah, how's that ice cream look at Gary's and melted yet? It is melting, yes. Here's my experiment. Um, this is about eight minutes, nine minutes now. So it takes about, we're going to guess, 15 minutes for a couple scoops of ice cream to melt, as you can see here, in this ridiculous heat and humidity we're having. In a minute, we're going to give away our weekly prize, $100 from Ben & Jerry's, $100 worth of ice cream. So we'll be doing that. And we got some kids here. Look at this. This is Maggie. Maggie, are you enjoying your ice cream? Yes. And are you enjoying yours? Yeah. Yeah, look at that face. This is what this contest is all about. <laughs> Take a picture of your kid eating ice cream and send it in. Go to NBCActionNews.com slash ice cream and enter our costume, our contest. That is just too cute. All right, we're out here. It's a little too hot. It's a little too humid. The thunderstorms have fallen apart. Let's take a look at our weather situation tonight, and we're going to look ahead to the weekend. Are you melting? Yeah, she's melting. Look at this. We're looking outside. Some cumulus clouds. The thunderstorms have moved off, and they're gone. And it's hot. It's humid. And 92 degrees. Look at our dew point. It's 79. Heat index 108. South southwest wind at 14. The ice cream's melting all over is the problem. 29.97. We can see there's a cold front. You can uh, there's a cold front approaching us at three inches per hour again. So if you get underneath one of these thunderstorms tomorrow afternoon, and I would guess the most likely time is between three o'clock and seven o'clock in the evening, we will definitely have some thunderstorms and it could rain a lot in a few spots. Then on Sunday, high pressure moving across southern Nebraska. Cooler. You see that word? Cooler. 80s. It's not going to be cold, but it'll be a little bit cooler and the humidity will come down.